sacrifices that all that I'm with you a profoundly touching tale from the Gospel of Luke, the heartwarming story of Jesus and Zacchaeus. This is not just a story of a simple encounter. It's a tale of redemption, compassion, and the transformative power of acceptance. It's a story that will captivate your attention and leave you reflecting on the power of grace and second chances. Imagine for a moment you find yourself in the shoes of Zacchaeus, a chief tax collector, despised by his community for his profession and seen as a sinner in the eyes of many. In a moment of vulnerability, you might confess that you have yearned for a chance to be seen as more than just your mistakes and be given an opportunity for a fresh start. Let's participate in this story together. How would you have felt if you were Zacchaeus, hearing that Jesus was passing through your town and feeling a longing in your heart to catch a glimpse of this compassionate man? What thoughts might have filled your mind as you climbed a sycamore tree just to get a better view of him? In a profound act of grace and acceptance, Jesus looks up at Zacchaeus in the tree and calls him by name, inviting himself to stay at his house. This simple act of acceptance transforms Zacchaeus' heart, prompting him to repent of his wrongdoings and pledge to give half of his wealth to the poor and repay those he has wronged fourfold. The story of Jesus and Zacchaeus challenges us to consider the transformative power of acceptance and the significance of second chances. It serves as a powerful reminder that no one is beyond the reach of God's grace, and every person, regardless of their past, is worthy of love and compassion. So, let me ask you, have you ever experienced moments when you longed for acceptance and a chance to change your ways, yearning for a fresh start in life? How can we draw inspiration from the story of Jesus and Zacchaeus to embrace the transformative power of grace, recognizing that through acceptance and compassion, lives can be changed and hearts can be transformed? As we delve into this captivating narrative, let us remember that accepting others with love and compassion can lead to powerful transformations in their lives. The story of Jesus and Zacchaeus reminds us that, like Zacchaeus, we all have the potential to experience the transformative power of acceptance and second chances, leading us to make positive changes in our lives and to live with compassion and love towards others. Let this story encourage us to see beyond the surface of people, to embrace grace, and to witness the miraculous transformation that can occur when love and acceptance are offered without judgment or reservation. Jesus, our Lord, came to seek and to save he sought me out and he called me by name Foolish and proud like a sheep gone astray He said, child to your house I will come today Much I have gained but I'll give even more Half of my wealth it was robbed from the poor Oh this injustice Lord help me restore for you called me by name and said, Sin no more. Salvation has come. Salvation has come to this house today. He said, It's more blessed to give than receive. To open my hands to the ones I've deceived. To bring reparation of all I have thieved. Hallelujah, hallelujah, yes, now I can see Salvation has come Salvation has come to this house today What I've taken from the poor I will give it all Christ won't be ignored I will 
Jesus, our Lord, comes to seek and to save the broken, the lost, and the sheep gone astray. Oh, lay down your treasures, for they're just golden chains. He says, child, I will come to your house today.